In recent years, many people have discovered or rediscovered that gardening and spending time in nature are great ways to alleviate stress and to feel more whole and connected. The Jacobs Garden in Beechwood, Ohio was designed 15 years ago for just this purpose. The homeowner, a busy surgeon, was new to gardening but wanted a relaxing retreat that felt set aside from the outside world. To bring this vision to life, Dr. Jacobs hired Salisbury Schweier Inc., an Akron, Ohio-based garden design firm headed by the husband-wife team of Samuel Salisbury and Sabrina Schweier. To tell us more about the process of designing this unique garden retreat, here's Sabrina. So when we designed the landscape, we took into account what the clients were looking for. Water, deck, outdoor living spaces, and it was really transforming the whole entire backyard. All of a sudden became a garden, and the water feature is significantly larger than you would normally use in a size property like this. That was the magic. We have found that water adds so much to a property. And try and include water as an element in as many projects as we can. Sometimes it may be a bird bath only, but if you can have that sound of running water and a still reflective space, it creates that sense of peace. It brings a tranquility and the sound of water is just magical. So the idea of creating sanctuary is about relating to all of the senses and creating this cocoon. The sensory experience of scent is there with roses and clethra and the sweet bay magnolia providing season-long interest and fragrance. Then there's the idea of the wind that blows through the wind chimes and they like the idea of edible landscapes. So we've incorporated pawpaws and you know, not just food for the birds, but you know, blackberries that they can pick and enjoy on their table. So all of the senses play a role in this. You know, the tactile, the visual, combination of plants, so that there's textural interest as well. Jacob's Garden was designed as a series of garden rooms. The main area is the deck right off the back of the house. And then these stepping stones lead across to these magical wonderland on the other side, a destination per se. The other direction is a little area of grass where they originally wanted to separate the grandchildren from the pond because they were concerned. So the fence and the gate keep the lawn area protected so that there's no children falling in ponds. But that help to really create that sense of an oasis from the neighborhood and the outside world. Wouldn't it be wonderful to have such an oasis in your own backyard? For more garden tour videos and horticultural inspiration, check out finegardening.com 